Now, plenty of other news out there. As we saw earlier, the collapse of Silicon Valley Bank and Signature Bank raised doubts on whether or not the Fed will continue to pursue its aggressive rate hike policy or trend in the coming week. Looking at Fed fund futures, 50 basis point hike, that uh, expectation is now off the cards. But could the latest U.S. inflation data start to shake things up? Well, this is what we're looking at today. The U.S. Consumer Price Index is expected to rise 6% in February year on year, decelerating from the 6.4% recorded in January. Core CPI also forecast to ease to 5.5% year on year after 5.6% in January. It follows Friday's jobs report, which showed a still tight labor market with more than 300,000 job creations uh, last month. But it also indicated that wage inflation remained on a downward trend, down 0.2% month on month, the lowest increase in a year. Now, let's take a look at uh, the euro uh, dollar uh, cross now. Current option prices show that traders of this Forex derivative expect more Forex volatility to be generated from Tuesday's CPI than Friday's U.S. jobs data alone. And overnight, the implied volatility for this cross is 20 versus 14 pre-NFP and 10 on a typical trading day with no event risk premium. So it's quite a big volatility change that we could be looking at when we get that CPI data later today. For more videos from us here at IGTV, join us on Twitter at IGCom, Instagram and subscribe to our YouTube channel.